Merry Christmas, everyone. What? It's not December. Okay, okay, you're right. It is July, but we are having Christmas in July where we can pretend for just a little bit that it's Christmas time. And this summer, we are talking about faith. And faith is trusting in what you cannot see by what you can see. That's right. And we can't see Jesus with our eyes, but we can put our faith in Jesus because we know who he is and what he has done. And that, my friends, is a gift. And we've talked a lot recently about Paul. Paul used to be known by Saul. Paul used to preach Jesus' message. He also wrote letters to the churches. A lot of those letters became books of the Bible. That's right. One of the people that he wrote letters to was in Ephesus. And the book of the Bible is Ephesians, which is where our memory verse comes from this month. It's from Ephesians 2, verses 8 and 9. And it says, God's grace has saved you because of your faith in Christ. Your salvation doesn't come from anything you do. It is God's gift. It is based on any, it is not based on anything you have done. No one can brag about earning it. I bet the Ephesians really need to be here that. I know I did. I can make a lot of mistakes and they can make me feel pretty crummy. That's right. When we look at people around us, we can think they are so perfect and I wish I was like her or I wish I could play baseball like him. But the fact is, is that nobody is perfect. Today when I walked in and I saw all these beautifully wrapped presents and then saw the way I wrapped my gift, I felt pretty embarrassed. It seems like everyone has it together and they're perfect. That's right. But the truth is everyone messes up. Take these, these gifts. If I flip them over, they're not so perfect anymore. Because the truth is, nobody is. Nobody is perfect except for Jesus. We all miss up. That's right, you don't have to do anything to earn God's love. In fact, it's just a gift. That's why God gave us the best gift ever, which is Jesus. Let's take another look at what Paul wrote in his letter. So in his letter he wrote, God's grace has saved you because you're of faith in Christ. Your salvation, doesn't come from anything you do. It is God's gift. That's right, salvation is God's gift. That means that when we put our trust in Jesus, that God forgives us for everything we've done and everything that we will do. When we put our trust in Him, we get to get that free gift. That's right. Jesus is a gift for everyone. He cleans up our messes and makes it beautiful again. That's right. And of course, as we follow Jesus, we're going to mess up but we just have to ask God to forgive us, and He always will. We do need to try to live the way that God wants us to live. We need to try to make wise choices. But we don't just do those things to earn something. We do those things because God loves us. That's the great news. Jesus, Jesus is, is a, a gift, gift for, for everyone. everyone. Hope City Kids, we miss you so much, and we are so excited for what we're going to be learning in July about how we can really put our faith in Jesus. We can't wait to see you again. Bye. Bye.